In this video, we would discuss the Six Sigma, the concept of Six Sigma, what is Six Sigma, why Six Sigma, how to implement Six Sigma, who is involved in Six Sigma. This uh, presentation would be very important for you if you are uh, in the area of the total quality management, quality management or engineering uh, area. Okay, so watch this video completely for the conceptual understanding of the Six Sigma. The Six Sigma is a discipline, a data driven approach. It's also called the uh, philosophy sometimes. Okay, uh, a methodology for eliminating defects driving towards six standard deviation between the mean and the nearest specification limit in any process from manufacturing to transactional and from product to services okay six sigma can not only be implemented in the manufacturing industry but it can be in a service industry as well the total quality management is also can be in the services and in the manufacturing and uh, Six Sigma discipline is uh, like to eliminating defects. The, the exact number is uh, that uh, it's, uh, is, it's uh, like statistical terms give the result of 3.4 defects per million opportunity. If your organization is producing the millions of product, there would be only 3.4 defects in the millions of the product if you have implemented Six Sigma properly in your business okay so that is the concept of the six sigma that is the 3.4 defects per million opportunities w typical goals of the six sigma once you implemented the six sigma what goal you would expect from the implementing six sigma it would dramatically lower cost okay if the defects uh, opportunities are very low if the defects are low scrape and rework are very low definitely there would be a lower cost okay improve improve the customer satisfaction once the customer is satisfied it like customer or the king it means that your organization your business would be success shorten the time to market reduce the defect scrape and rework it simplify all the operations there are some tools in the six sigma that can be used in a process in operation to reduce to eliminate all of the waste like there are seven type of waste inventory uh, motion etc okay so if you optimize that there is definitely there would be simplify the operation it improve the competitive position okay once you implement this there would be a lower cost the customer would be satisfied shorten time to market reduce the defect scrape and rework simplify the operation so definitely you would be ranking the uh, competitive environment okay six sigma what are the uh, principles of the six sigma uh, principle of the six sigma the first one is it focus on the customer okay because customers are the king okay continuous process improvement it doesn't mean that once you improve the process for two percentage five percentage you would reach to hundred percent you cannot even reach to 100% so there is a cycle like PDCA there is a cycle that you would be improve the process again and again again and again okay to optimize that or go to be uh, nearly go to the 100 percentage okay so this six sigma uh, focus on the continuous process improvement leading by example company wide implementation business strategy integration decision making using statistical analysis six sigma is a statistical analysis like it different from lean because of the statistical analysis uh, there is a normal distribution use customer like uh, process capability cp like, like their terms are used in the six sigma okay which is statistical terms the six sigma key terms are the management steering committee strategic direction six sigma projects six sigma black belts there are also other blacks like uh, green belt yellow belt okay master black belt okay six sigma measures quality improvement facilitators okay but to why six sigma if there is no six sigma what would happen okay the word sigma is a statistical term that measure how far a given process deviate from perfection 
from the desired value okay this is like a standard deviation meaning that six sigma is a statistical term that measure how far a given process deviate from perfection from the standard value from the desired value the central idea behind six sigma is that if you can measure how many defects you have in a process okay if you find the defects the number of defects the cause of defect you can systematically figure how to eliminate them okay you would be using the tools you would be using the lean tools total quality management tools to figure out how to eliminate them and get close to zero defects there are there is impossible to go to the uh, zero defects but six sigma tries to tries to and motivate us to go to the z close get close to the zero defects uh, for any process or the system okay this is the whole concept of the six sigma so i hope you learned something from this video so if you do learn make sure to like this video comment and thanks for watching